I am sure that our Tuareg brothers will be welcome in the new Malian government. And the military has already said so. They say that they are going to hold the Algiers Peace Agreement, the inclusive national dialogue which was held in Mali. So in both these documents, there are the concerns of our brothers in northern Mali who have expressed themselves and appropriate solutions have been drawn up. Now we are going to have to apply them. I do not see any drawbacks, not at all, in the fact that our brothers from the north are joining the government because it will be very important for them to join the government, given that there are many things to be done and if we have to do them, they have to be there with us to do it. We see no obstacles to that. The DDR is there. The fighters from North Mali who have fought alongside the brothers are there. Now they are in the process of joining the Malian army. They are fighting with their brothers in the south, the east, the center, and so on. But all these problems in the north mean that Mali is facing a general development problem in all regions. They have claimed their rights. They have claimed their rights. And that has titillated awakened consciousness. Now on the question of whether they should be part now on the question of whether they should be part of the government, yes, they have to be part of the government. Not just the government, they have to get involved in everything that is going to happen and especially in everything that concerns Mali in general particularly in the northern region, because they are experiencing these problems of insecurity and underdevelopment on a daily basis.